cause others nursing injuries following fresh clashes witnessed between two warring communities in the area. Now the incident has ignited concerns among communities living in the area who are now demanding for a permanent solution to the recurring border clashes. Sheila Chilangat with more. All right. Tense atmosphere on the Kericho Sondu border. This follows last night's brutal attack, allegedly carried out by a gang armed with bows and arrows, leaving a trail of destruction. Three lives were lost and scores injured as the armed gang targeted areas near Sondu Market, stealing cattle, prompting the locals to raise their voices. Echoing their frustration and anger, they took to the streets barricading the road as they demanded for justice. <laughs> As this crisis unfolds, President William Ruto's expected visit to the Nyanza region on Friday looms, casting a shadow over the already tense situation. last month, but one way. Kisumu Governor Anyang Nyongo has condemned the incident, demanding for swift response from the government and a permanent solution to the border issue that has plagued the region for decades. We want the regime in power to suspend any other activities, planned or ongoing, and focus on stopping these killings. Similar clashes have been witnessed in the area with the most recent happening in July this year, with residents now hoping for a long-lasting solution. Sasa tunaomba sirikali, tafadhalini. Sisi atulali usiku, sisi tunakatu paka subui. Sasa tumeomba ata hii mishidi. To prevent further destruction and chaos, security in the area has been heightened. Sheila Chelangat for TV 47. Right, and we are getting breaking news just now. There has been a reshuffle of the cabinet.